Who's that gemin over there? Remind him! <laughs> Oh eight four five one two three four five six. All commitment helpline needs to help these guys. It's going to Stefan Wade, Perso Ascot, and Dcartier. And we're mad them on the wall. And we just want to give a big shout out to Media Spotlight UK. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> What's good, it's Richie Driss from Media Spotlight UK and I'm here at Hackney Empire, by the way, with the Mandem on the Wall crew. Yo, yo, yo! Yeah. And you are a crew, let's not get it twisted. There's three of you, but you are a crew. Yeah, we're kind of a crew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're kind of a crew. Yes, you know, it's potato, 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 isn't it? compared us to so solid crew. I yeah, knew yeah, it, I knew it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are a crew, all three of you, you are a crew. Can you cool. go ahead and introduce yourselves one by one? Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm Perso Ascot, I play younger baby Tani Whiny. My name is Javan Wade, I play Failure. And my name's D Cartier and I play Baker. Cool, perfect. Now, first things first, I want to get my priorities straight. Let's so, this. Uh -huh. my first question is, to be part of Mandem on the Wall, Yeah. Like, is there like an initiation? Is there something, I've got, have I got like walk through lava? Or is it even do possible you know, to do you know, be part of Do you know what it is? It, it is possible, but yeah, what, you would, what, yeah, what you would have to do yeah. is go back in time three <laughs> and a half years and be there when we first met. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Yeah, other than that, I, I, I don't think there is, <laughs> yeah, is a possible yeah. way. I mean, <laughs> what do you think, guys? Nah, nah, nah. That's so clever. <laughs> nah, you hit the nail on the head. My time machine is ready and ready. <laughs> That's fine. Now, in, in, in any group, in any boy band, in any crew, in any, anything, there's always, like, the sweet boy, there's always, like, the thug, and there's always the intelligent yeah, boy. Yeah, yeah. I don't mean your characters, because that's pretty obvious. Yeah. I like Off how you labelled us a boy band, you know? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, yeah. That's, that's, that's sort of vibe. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, you got the sweet boy, you got, like, the intelligent one, and then you got, like, the thug. Yeah. Who's who? Well, I mean, um, I could guess. It's I, it's I, it's, I, it's I, obvious. I, no. I could get. I could. I well, I could have guessed. Yeah. Yeah. Go on. I, I was going to say. Go on. I was going to say, Percy the sweet boy. Yeah, and but I, I'm the intelligent one. <laughs> <laughs> but going through your Instagrams, I did a little bit of Instagrams. Ooh, okay. 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 Right. Here we right. go. Okay. Oh, one yeah. of us. Oh one of us. <laughs> oh one of us goodness. had um, like seventy-five percent, no, eighty percent of our Instagram photos were definitely like. Aimed at the opposite sex and the <laughs> topless pictures. And yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> definitely. definitely. Yeah, boy. We have our sweet boy in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> definitely. But go on, if you could allocate yourselves. Um, I, 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 I don't know. Those categories are kind of. Yeah, we're, we're, you've got sweet boys, you've got. Uh, and but what we are, we, yeah, we're, we're something different. Yeah. I'm, I'm the kind of guy that is here, but he's not there mm. and he's here. You know what I'm saying? And then uh, Jay. But at the same time, I'm the kind of guy that's everywhere without being there if you're not there. Do yeah, you know what and, I mean? And, and my character is the guy that knows, you know, he knows, but at the end of the day, he knows. Exactly. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the kind of dynamic that we cool, have. Cool, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that dynamic, that classic right. dynamic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There's a lot of people like that. <laughs> <laughs> Briefly, how did you all meet? How did this whole cool, whole okay. Let's try and do this briefly, yeah? yeah okay, yeah. cool. Uh, okay, all right then. In 2011, we met up uh, at Variety Showcase. Myself and Joanne did a comedy duo set. Yep. Did you have a uh, deep uh, perform stand up comedy? Mm -hmm. I did. I'm waiting for someone to kind of take over. Okay, um, <laughs> yeah, uh, <laughs> it's a bit perform, perform stand up comedy. Um, yeah, we kind of came together and we just said, look, we want to make something, we want to create our own opportunities. We met up the next week, we created Man on a Wall, we released it uh, about three months after that. 20,000 views in one night, four months later, wow. Youngers. And, and then, then D Wappen in 2016? Yeah. Success. <laughs> ah. Love that. In a nutshell. 2016 has happened. Bruh. No, 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 no bro. <laughs> 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 I rate what you did there. I saw what you did there. Short story long. Nice, I like it. like it. Um, now, I couldn't help but notice the man on the wall. A lot of it appears to be like taking real life, putting a comedy twist on it. Mm -hmm. like, yeah. Moving to the girls. Yeah. It was, oh, was in pieces. <laughs> How, what percentage of man on the wall do you reckon is like real life? Like what percentage of the whole thing, the whole to, series? To, to be honest, you took from real life. Yeah. The, the whole series yeah, is from yeah. real life. I think, yeah, we, we exaggerate. Yeah, we exaggerate moments and we exaggerate the truth. But right. the, the, the they're inspired from yeah, moments. It, in I our think lives. if it wasn't truthful, you guys wouldn't laugh. Right, Do you know, what I mean? you can so relate to I agree. it. And that's, I agree. Yeah, yeah, you know, um, I, I did get Ed at a time in my <laughs> life. And, um, you know, since then, I have to say I'm a recovering, airing, you know, person and I'm there now. You're an air cadet. So I'm an air cadet. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. All three of you, all three of you were, were not with the same girl, but at one point or another saying, 
Yeah, 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 yeah. Similar, similar girl. Similar girl. Was the same. We thought, yeah, but it was triplets. They were actually triplets. Yeah. So, so that's actually they're, true. They were actually triplets. They were never alike. They're, they were actually triplets. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's to be fair, yeah, you can't even um, you can't even make that sort of stuff up. Yeah, no, exactly. You can't. You can't, exactly. you can't write that. It's priceless. Okay, um, I've got a trust exercise to do real quick. Cool. Let's do it. I need. You can't do it about yourself. It's about each other. I need one embarrassing story about each of you that we haven't seen from Mandem on the Wall. Okay. Yeah. There's gonna be one. I don't. Do you lead the way? Me lead the way. Lead the way. Uh, uh, Nominate someone else and then more <laughs> embarrassing facts. Embarrassing please. story about who? Percy or it's, Javan? It's entirely up to you. Yeah. It's All up right. to you, man. Okay. We'll see um, who's got the most dirt on who's got the most dirt on them at the end of this. Because if you all pick on Percy, for example. Yeah. All right. All right. No, you can all pick on me if you want. <laughs> 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 How about this? Um, we are dedicated believers in the bro code, right? Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. within the bro code, there is a rule. Mm-hmm. You do not embarrass a fellow man them. Ooh. And guess what? I am not going to partake Ooh. in that. Uh, so, in your face! <laughs> <laughs> Love that. Okay, next. Someone will. <laughs> um, do, do, do you know what? <laughs> embarrassing moments. Okay, let me, let me see if I can get one. Um, embarrassing moments, embarrassing moments, embarrassing moments, embarrassing moments. Okay, yeah, this is a show we shared before. Um, embarrassing moment. Uh, I'm going to pick on Percy. Cool. Um, Go on. This moment was... You know, we've been friends a long time now. We have been and friends a long um, time. There was there was a, a time where we was on a train together. We was on this train. And um, <laughs> yeah, Percy had these um, these trainers on. And, um, Boy. Th- I looked at the. Tra- I'm, I'm a lover of trainers, you know, as you as you can see. <laughs> um, <laughs> and I, I I looked at the trainers and I looked at the boy and I said. There wasn't any words though. Yeah, it was just. It was through eyes, and that's how we knew. You know, Jay kind of kindly explained to me that these trainers weren't. Weren't they weren't okay? Cool. Oh, okay. You well, know, you know when crocs. wearing, they weren't even that, man. They weren't not they even crocs. Not even nah, crocs. Slippers man. with, nah, man. They, Slippers they, with socks. They, um, this was at a time when, uh, you know, we we hadn't had got the success yet. Do you know what I'm saying? So yeah. at a time where you know I was still working my part time job, but now I don't know, know what they were called. Uh, uh, Let's just call them a bad experience. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but from that moment, I knew that Jay was my brother. I looked at him honestly. and honestly, because yeah, he yeah. he gave me the honest truth, and I was like, cool, you know, we're brothers. Deep okay. stuff, man. Thanks. Thanks man. Real, so much for that bro code. <laughs> 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 Last but not least. Um, embarrassing story. I'd embarrassing pick on story. D. If I was you, I'd pick on embarrassing D. Embarrassing story. Why would I pick on D? Because of that bro code thing that backfired. <laughs> no. <laughs> 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 by the way, by the way, by the way, real quick. I'm not going to call you D anymore. I'm going to call you Kendrick. K dot. Kendrick. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. That, yeah. that, that, that yeah. likeness is yeah. Kendrick's unreal. doing well at the moment. So <laughs> he I'm is. Gonna, I'm You're doing well. Embrace that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So you I'm are doing well at the moment. <laughs> yes, you, you are. Something coming. We <laughs> 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 yeah. I'm not going to skip. I'm not going to skip. I'm not going to skip. You know when you think about an embarrassing story? I don't have. I don't have an embarrassing story. No, not really. Don't really have. Maybe I think I've been on the end of the embarrassing stories, you see. You've gone about yourself? I'm the more, you know, the trainer thing was oh, okay. embarrassed. I think I've shed what were those trainers? Ah, man. Like Let's just. LA gear, flashing lights. Nah, ones. no, they were actually nice. LA gears were sick. Yeah, but when you were four. Okay, let's put it this way. <laughs> it's time to skate, but I don't know where the fuck I'm headed. Up or down, right? <laughs> Put it this way, they, they were, they were, you know, them skater kicks, you know, them grunger, <laughs> you know, them, you know, what I'm talking about. Is it DCs? Nah, they were Nike, but okay. they weren't like the like DCs are the trend. You know what I'm saying? But right. these were not cool, man. Okay, okay, we'll take that. Thank you. You've got your um, you've got your live show coming, Tapney. Yeah, uh, yeah. What can the fans expect, and what is going to be different about it compared to watching it on YouTube? Yeah. Um, first of all, I'd say everything, man. Um, we have nothing in the live show. Yeah. That that is you know, seen that you've seen before. All the sketches are, are, are original material. We yeah. have parodies, which are original material. <coughs> things that won't ever be online. Um, that you can only come if uh, can't come and see if you come to the live show. Um, um, and I think it's, it's it's best that way. Do you know what I mean? Otherwise, what are people paying for? What are people taking their time out to come and see? They would be able to just watch it at home. I think also just to say that we play different characters. There's yeah. versatility and stuff like that. So that's also a, a nice factor for the audience to see. And also just like you know, we've been writing Man and All for three and a half years now, and you can imagine that we've only grown each year. You know, with this concept and this brand. So now, now we're taking it to the live show. You know, you can imagine just what we've got in store for people after you know we've got a million views in our first episode, our amazing. first project. So amazing. Yeah, man, it's gonna be good. Okay, I've got one question. Two, well, two more questions, real quick. Right, first, your heroes and your influences. Cool. So um, <coughs> yeah, I'm gonna start with uh, an influence. Yeah, yeah. One, one guy that's influenced me um, creatively, Rowan Atkinson. Okay. Yes. Uh, 
what he did with Mr. Bean was amazing. Okay. And um, Hero right, right now, again, creatively, and also, you know, what he's doing within the industry is amazing. Kevin Hart, you know Agreed. what I mean? He's breaking through massive doors, so. Um, for myself, uh, there's a lot of kind of inspiration generically, but I always kind of nail to one, and that's Will Smith, man, um, in terms of his... The, the, when it comes to the craft, but not only the craft, but his just generic lifestyle and the way he lives, his his beliefs, his belief system, do you know what I mean? In terms of just working hard and I watch a lot of his videos and stuff and, and really kind of having someone to be able to look up to when you kind of are on this journey, there's not many people around that you can kind of find and you can look up to and, and allow to challenge you. So yeah, Will Smith is definitely cool. an inspiration of mine. Cool. Uh, mine's closer to home. Uh, I'd have to say my dad. Um, the reason why, ever since I was young, um, I've always been trying to model myself around him. And cool. yeah, man, you know, it's close to me and he inspires me. Love that. So we know who the sweet boy is. <laughs> 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 nah, fair play. Love that. Love that. Right, real quick, quick fire round. I'm going to start things nice and easy. Rihanna, Beyonce, or Megan Good? Well, for what, though? Whatever the hell you want. Oh. Real quick, real okay, quick. Okay, um, uh, Beyonce. Megan Beyonce good. and Megan Good and Megan Good yeah. Rita Ora <laughs> Iggy Azalea or Ariana Grande so, so say that again Who? Rita Ora Iggy Azalea or Ariana Grande uh, Iggy. Uh, Iggy. Uh, 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 but I, Iggy she don't even speak English no more yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. real quick Rita Rita man yeah, I have to say Rita Rita, Rita as well Rita. okay scoring the winning goal for your country in the World Cup final yeah. winning an Oscar or selling out Wembley Arena and the gig is broadcast all over the world. <laughs> Which is selling make. out Wembley Arena. <laughs> yeah. No. Um, all winning an Oscar. Winning an Oscar, man. Winning, winning an Oscar. Oscar. Winning yeah. Oscar selling yeah. out an arena. Lads, thank you very much. Really appreciate yeah, it. Thank, thank you, you man. Chris, for Media Spotlight UK. Peace. <laughs>